Hello and welcome again, this is Invisible with you Doing Sphinx the Crystal Mummy And this is part 2 of the special video about the mythology of the Egyptians While we're running towards the Cursed Palace We're going to... I'm going to tell you about uh, The continuing of the Egyptian mythology So I just uh, googled in Wikipedia about Isis So what do I have about her? About her? Um, About Isis, uh, ancient uh, Greek origin. Um, <coughs> uh, most likely, she is called Isis. Is the goddess of ancient Egypt, ancient religions, belief, whose worship spread through for the Roman world. Um, she was worshipped as a, an ideal mother and wife, as well as a part tones of nature and magic where did I go? by the way I'm not looking at my playstation 2 screen I'm looking at my laptop while uh, explaining to you and this is not the cursed palace at all that's the cursed palace fine we're going to go to it the hard way um, and up here she she was a friend, uh, she was a fr the friend of slaves, sinner and art sense. Uh, and the downtrodden, I don't know what this word is, she listened to the prayers of the wealthy maids. Sphinx, please give me a break, okay? I need to focus a little bit on reading this my mythology, a little bit. Okay, um, <coughs> and you, you know what, just let's reach up uh, the chamber of Anubis, then I will continue to you about Isis and the other ones, okay? <coughs> just a second. I know I don't know why exactly I took the hard way. I can just use the portal with the mystical amulet of Anubis. Anyway, <coughs> I will read to you Isis and Anubis F1 after another. So be patient a little bit. Okay? Come on now. Before we enter much more directly into Anubis chamber, I will stop for now and talk about the mythology pretty fast. Because the game is about to end. Okay, so. <coughs> she was a friend of slaves, sinners, and artisans, and uh, don't, uh, don't trod. And she listened to the prayers, the world, and maid, maidens, uh, whatever, uh, and rulers. Isis is often depicted as the mother of Horus, the hawk headed god of war and protection. Although in some traditions, Horus' mother is Hathor. Isis is also known as a protector of the dead and goddess of children. The name Isis means throne. Her headdress, uh, her headdress, is a throne. Oh, her head, her hat, is a throne as the purse. I don't know what this word is. She was important representers representation of the pharaoh's power the pharaoh was depicted as her child who sat on his throne she provided her cult was popular uh, through egypt but her most important temples were at behibit el behibit el hagar and the nile Delta. At the beginning of the reign with the Mictobia, um, that's all you should know for this time, for the meantime. Ah, oh. Isis was the first daughter of Gib, the god of the earth, and not the goddess of the sky. And she was born on the fourth intercalary day. 
She married her brother Osiris, and she conceived Horus with him. Isis was instrumental in in resurrection of the Osiris when he was murdered by Set. Using her magic skills, she restored his body to life after having gathered the body parts that had been strewn uh, about the earth by Set. Wow. So, Set indeed killed his brother. Anyway, uh, about Anubis. Give me a moment, I will Google him for you. <laughs> Where is Anubis? Um, here, Horus. No, I need Anubis. Horus Set. Uh, what do you have about Set? Okay, uh, set. Also spelled Sitish. Sikta and Siti or whatever. A god of the desert, storm, and foreigner in ancient Egypt religions. In literal myth, he, he is also the god of darkness and chaos. Um, in, in ancient Greek, the god's name is given by Set. In Egyptian. Uh, Mythology set is Port Taylor Port Rare as the soup as the usurper that killed and melted his own murdered his own brother Osiris. Osiris' wife Isis resembled Osiris' corpse and embalmed Im him Osiris' son Horus sought revenge upon Set. So, Horus should not uh, help Set, but she should be fighting him for revenge. Wow. And he, the myth described their conflict, the death of Osiris and the battle between Horus and Set is a popular theme in Egypt mythology. Wow. So, this game has a freaking weird conflict about this. Because, well, you know that now Horus is helping Set while he should be fighting him. Anyway, not to make this video too long for you, I'm going to try to look for you, Anubis, and that's it. Okay, Anubis. Okay, so <coughs> Anubis is the name of jackal headed god associated with mummification and the afterlife in ancient Egypt religions. He is the son of Niftas and Set, according to the Egyptian mythology. According to the Akkadian transcription, in the Amama letter, Anubis' name was vocalized Egyptian as Anapa. The oldest known mention of Anubis is the Old Kingdom Pyramid text, where he is associated with the burial of the Pharaoh. At this time, Anubis was the most important god of the dead but he was replaced during the middle kingdom by Osiris wow cool his name he takes his, na his name in connection with the funerary rule as he who is upon his mountain which undersakes his importance as the protector of the descent and their tombs, and the and the title who who he who is the place of embling associated with him with the process of mummifical perfection like many ancient Egypt deities, whatever. Um, I don't believe it's enough information at the meantime for now about Elvis. 
I want to show you about a version about Amon, which we took his hands to uh, move these things. Let me give me a moment so I can try to build it. Okay. <laughs> about Amon, what do we have here? He was attested since the old kingdom together with his spouse Amon with the 11th dynasty. Uh, he rose the position, okay, whatever. And after the rebel of the fables against the haters, I can't get. Um, is he something like a, of something or anything else at all? Because, um, well, never mind about it. If you want to know about it, just uh, Google him. Let me show you how Anubis looks like in the ancient Egypt mythology. Give me a moment. Okay, so guys, this is Anubis. The jackal headed thingy. Okay? Let me go back again so you can see Set and how much is they are both familiar with each other. This is Set. You can Wikipedia him. Okay? This is... Um, wait a minute. Give me a moment, please, here. Set, no, not Set. I want to show you Isis. Give me a second. Here, no, this no. I want Isis. Okay, come on now, Isis. Here, this one should be Isis. Hey, this is Isis. Okay, now about Osiris. Osiris, give me a moment, please. Here. Wait a minute, Osiris, where is he? Uh, Osiris... Here, this is Osiris. Um, Azar, Azari, uh, Azar, Ozar, Azar, whatever. Um, this is Gib, the god of the earth. Uh, then do they have any uh, picture of him? Anyway, this is how you call his name in the ancient Egypt texture. As well, you have not. Where is not his wife, the girl of the sky? Um, where is she exactly? Not, 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 not. It is not. I hope they have. Yes. Uh, <coughs> about not. Um, she was girl <laughs> of the sky. And they thought about her as a giant woman that is um, spreading all over the sky for some reason. Hey! Oh, good. They believe that this is not. Because of the sky. How weird. Okay, I'll try to get you some pictures of Gib. The, the earth thing. Come on now. Yes, I'm using uh, Google. No problem with that. So, Egypt myths Gib. Um, so, this is Nit and Gib, I do believe. He really made a very long comment. <laughs> God, <laughs> yep. So this is Gib. This is Gib, and this is Net. How such a weird freaking mythology. Anyway, I don't believe that's about it for this video. Next video, we're going to fight the final showdown. So then, you know that don't like it if you enjoy subscribe for more videos in the future. Please comment, and I hope to see you in the next. Uh huh. Part of this. Walk through. Atom, show, Tifnut, Gib, Nut, Osiris, Isis, Nif, Nifethis, and Sith.
I will leave for you this one <laughs> to search about. Anyway, invisible with you, looking good. So, guys, good luck. Here comes another slash.